All right, all right, all right. Welcome, 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 ladies and gentlemen, to your Friday night horror night with J2 the Dilla. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I know it's been kind of maybe a week since last time we streamed. Again, as always, I'm busy with job, work, and whatnot. But we will continue it today. Um, give me just one second, as always, ladies and gentlemen. Get your popcorn ready. Get your drinks ready. I'm about to start this in just one second. All right. So last time, if I remember correctly, we did almost everything. We needed the modisk. Where we're at. Okay. We need the Mo Disc and what else do we need? This we can't open it electronically. That door also the um it's door in here. Anyways, hope y'all are doing good today. Hope everything is fine and dandy. Hope you're having a beautiful Friday night. Thank you for chilling with me. As always, appreciate it. This is the room that we need to find the um, the code for. Mm -hmm. Can I get someone? Let's do that one more time. There's something scrawled on the notepad to use the electronic door please initials place the initials in the alphabetical order which I did John Ada okay so that's the call in Fargus. Lever. Lungs. So it would be... So it would be... Call and see. Asparagus. Asparagus will be E. Lungs and liver will be L. Cell. Okay. Hopefully that's it. We got that down. Now let's get to the next room over. And I believe this is where we needed the uh, Mo disc. Come on. Yes, sir. Ah. Transmit. Transmitting the passcode. Seems to have unlocked something. Okay. So we need two more of those. 
Let's grab this pink ribbon. So we'll we'll have this room completely green. As so. What does it say? There's no ID badge, okay. I thought it said there's an ID badge, but grab it! Grab it! Okay. Let's go to that passcode room. Let's put John Ada and then we use that cell code, see if it works. We also need to get the uh, second mod. This can bring it there. Verified. Password. I guess we were right. Wow, okay. I guess we were right. B3. It's unlocked already. It. I mean, there's nothing else, right? And we're completely done over here. So let's go put away the um, that ink ribbon. Let's see. Also, we need to get that second mod disc and. Where do we put it? We haven't found the second mod transmitter. It's probably in that room upstairs. It's probably in this room. Let's go over here and put this back first. And grab the mod disc. Just in case. Disc. Okay. Okay. Let's look at this first. Let's grab it. Passcode entry terminal. Use it. Um how many codes is it one? Four, okay. Okay, no problem. Oh, you know what we need? We need that, um... That red... Projector thingy. Ooh, ammo. Security protocols. Heliport. Fox executive use only. This was... This uh, restriction does not apply in the event of emergency. Passage to heliport entry is prohibited unless accompanied by a consultant researcher of, or the chief of security. Unauthorized persons entering the heliport will be shot on site. Elevator. The elevator stops during emergencies. Visual data room for use by the special research division only. All other access to the divi- oh, 
the uh, visual data room must be cleared with Keith Harving, room manager. Prison sanitation division controls the use of this, the use of the prison. At least one consultant researcher, E. Smith S. Ross A. Wesker, ooh, Wesker, must be present and viral use is authorized. Triple lock door. Machine the room is limited. To the sole person who deactivates the lock with all the all the passcodes. Assessing ex 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 exclusive output terminals located in, this, in each section of the senior researchers deactivates the lock. Huh? Hmm. Triple lock door, okay. Power room in this room. Your compound is used as a primary fuel source of power. Access is limited to the headquarters supervisor. This restriction may not apply to consultant researcher with special authorization. Passcode output terminals used and access to output terminals is limited to authorized senior researchers. Regarding the progress of tyrant after the administration of T virus. Eligible hereafter. Huh. Okay. So I get one second to drink some water. There doesn't seem to be anything important. Okay. Okay, so we need the red. There's a map of the laboratory. Take it, yes. Alright, let's go back. Put away the mods. Pick up the overhead projector thingy. Slides. And come back and pick up what you call it. That first aid kit. And see what we're gonna see. We'll see what we're gonna see. We need all right. Aid. We're not green. There must be something else here. I made their nine zero barriers. F one three Neptune Hunter. I hate these bastards. Hate them. Tyrant? Who? <gasps> Wesker. Bioorganic Weapon Research Group Development Staff. 83417026233. That's supposed to mean. Code, I bet you meant something. Um. I'm gonna write this down just in case because it seems like we might need it, you know. 
And why the heck would you have such a thing like this written down? Eight, three, four, one, seven, oh, six, two, three. Okay. Hmm. Now, let's put this bioorganic weapon, official report, reverse. Same thing. <gasps> it's a call. Eight four. Eight four. Six two. Okay. Okay. Eight four six two. Yes. Laboratory key. I'm not gonna pick it up just yet. Just... Oh no. Some sort of image editing equipment. Looks like you can use it to view Kenneth's films. View the film. Uh, oh, that's the guy that was eating. That was the guy that was eating the first guy. Okay, laboratory. We got it. Green, we're done. Okay. Should put that HP away, but we'll see. Labrador key. Where would that be? Let's go down here. Oh, I guess I was right. That's where the lag is. What is that sound, bro? It's too freaky, bro. The heck? Jesus loves me. What are those bastards? Ah, various position instruments used in surgery. Covered in blood. His blood doesn't look like it came from a surgery though. Yep. It's 
trust the shirt and won't budge. That's nice. We came from there. So either we can go from here. Oh, that's what. No, oh, okay, I get it. Oh, yes, baby. No, no, no. Don't push that. Okay. Let's go through. And let's go on this side. Shells full of bears and fish. Okay, we'll take the glass grenade. Oh, it's my disc. We don't have any mod disc with us. Go through. One more. Okay. Where is this at? It's where this takes us. Same place, same place. Yeah. Okay. Let's go get the mod disc first. Let's go get the mod disc. This is freaky. These I hate these bugs. Bug zombies, man. That's why I never beat Resident Evil Zero or whatever it is, because he had those bugs. Or whatever. I was like, nah, I'm good. It was completely in a, completely different than Resident Evil One, because Resident Evil One, you just shoot the zombies, and you die, not the bugs. We come back over and over. I'll tell you what, though. I got HP for days. Probably have to use that all for the uh, boss. Try this again. Stem with the mod disc. Right. Is it right here? Ah, it came all everything moved back as it was, huh? Hmm. 
Okay. Come on. Oh, I was gonna say. Okay. Okay. Okay, there's nothing else. Put your bag nice and pop it. You need to keep the bag is quite old. Guess that's it. Are we going to the next one? Ooh, that's a long ass place to the bottom right of the map. Okay. I think we should get the other mod key. Most likely it's going to be here. Okay, let's go get the mod key. The mod disc, I mean. Most likely we're going to use it. I don't want it. Okay. this let's go in baby that's what we got let's see what we got no auto aim let's rest this shot great Oh man. What the hell? Love it isn't working. Looks like you'll have to operate the switch on the right hand side. It appears to be the control panel a little bit. Doesn't seem to be getting any power. Okay, so we need power. Maybe we can go straight, so we can go down. Let's go straight. Small room. Let's go see what's inside. Oh, it's safe house. Nice. There's an anchor of two over there. Shotgun shells. There's magnum shells. Let's go put this away. OK. 
grab. And let's go pick up the magnum shells. Put that away too. And we'll pick up the ink ribbon. I guess we can't go through there. Okay. That is that. What we got here? Oh no. Sounds like it's to the right, like over here, somewhere there, in the middle. That guy came out of nowhere. Okay. That's okay, I'm gonna go all around, baby. I'm gonna go all around. The hell was that? He didn't get shot. He got shot in the head. Where am I? I'm lost. Where you at? Ugly ass monster. Let's go here. Three shots, but it's because it's my fault. Warning: fuel may explode if shaken or jarred. The refueling device for the power room—it's not working right now because there's no fuel. There's an empty capsule. Do you take the fuel caps? Oh. Shaking and explode, but I remember that room we went to it said something about if you Move too much or whatever it's gonna explode. Okay Okay Go down further. Maybe we shouldn't go further. Maybe we should go get the power first. Let's go get the power first. Because maybe down... The reason I'm saying let's go get the power first, because maybe down further, there needs to be power to move on. Anyways, I'm trying to think, where the hell was that room at? Where the hell was that room? That needed power. Or you can get that power, whatever.
think it's on this side. I think it's over here. Yep, right there. It looks like a refueling device. Yep. Let's go, baby. You got the fuel cap supply. Burning could result in a fatal explosion. Okay. We're not gonna run. That's for sure. We're gonna walk our way all the way to that place. No running, baby. Take these, take the steps easy, buddy. You don't explode. I want to run and see what happens. Should have saved. Okay, so I don't have it no more, so I can run. Okay. Let's continue, baby. He was gonna hit me. That bass, you saw that? He's gonna swing at me. There we go, baby. There we go. Okay.
Okay. Is that it? There's more. There's no power to the main elevator. Start it up. The lab self-destruct me mechanism is it's huge. Oh, this is self-destruct? Now what? Good. I guess we're good. See, we needed to have that power to get this started. It's a good thing we got the power first, then we went further on. Elevator. Pretty much. We can, wait a minute. I missed something. I didn't pick up something from the other side. Let's go back and get it. There was something on the ground here, or somewhere. I didn't pick up. Ah. All right, now we're good. That's a flashbang. Flashbangs are good. Is that the elevator? No, no, no. Wrong side. Wrong side. What I want to know is where's the elevator going to take us? Should I grab something else? Before we take the elevator, let's go through that electronic. Hmm. Should we take the elevator? Should we not take the elevator? Let's take. Let's go over here. Release the door locks. Looks usable. Pull it. Yes. Yeah. 
Shall we? Oh, shoot. Chris? Jill. It's Jill. Chris, Wesker's the... I know. I can't open it. Just wait. I'll be back. Okay. What are you doing there? That's a trip. Okay, now I guess we get in the elevator. waiting for the elevator to come up I'm like what the hell is going on okay never mind derp 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 that's, that's pretty funny shotgun shells for a sec I thought it was like just a some sort of Battery box or something, you know? Oh. Wesker. So you've come. Chris, you make me proud. But of course, you are one of my men. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> Since when, Wesker? I'm afraid I don't know what you're talking about. Since when have they been slipping you a paycheck? I think you're a bit confused. I've always been with Umbrella. And stars were Umbrella's... No. Rather, my little piggies. Huh? The Tyrant virus leaked, polluting this whole place, and unfortunately, I had to give up my lovely members of stars. You killed Enrico with your own dirty hands! You son of a bitch! G -g Enrico? Yes. I'm a fair man. I'll destroy all of you stars along with this entire place. You. Time for show and tell. Get up. Parents.
ultimate life form. Tyrant. <laughs> Wesker, you've become senile. Chris, you'll never understand. It's magnificent. Yep. Magnificent, all right. Come on, you test tube freak. Jesus loves me. What a pathetic way to die. He's holding something. Observation note. This COVID G virus was the was in fact twenty twenty one years after administration of the primary generator virus. The prototype parasite which we had delivered from a laboratory in France was administrated to the sample. It's always from like another country, foreign country. Always. Specimen sample specimen took in the parasite without showing any signs of adverse reaction. The lack of any reaction was an unsolved mystery, but now everything is clear to me now. Prototype parasite was incubating in the sample specimen body for 21 years, and, f and from that incubating state of the prototype suddenly mutated, evolved, may, may be more appropriate word to describe it. This obser observation gave me more insight in my research. To further m modification and testing, I was able to derive a method to create a, the G virus, the G that suppressed the performance of the T. This was a breakthrough that would change the future of the bowels history. Can't wait to see the look of, I well, can't wait to see the look on Lexia's annoying face when I finally announce my research. But unfortunately, I'll have to wait a few more years Completely verify my finding, William Birkin. William Birkin Wesker. For one more hit, I was gonna be dead. I didn't bring no HP with me, nothing. Door is electronic unlock. Looks like it does so automatically in case of emergency. Uh, okay. Is there anything I can do? So get some HP, because we need it. We have plenty of it.
But you know what? I have to help. There was a stash box room right there. I just passed it. Yes, sir. All right. Put this away. We'll get the Magnum. There's nothing else for me to use, right? Nope. Let's get an HP. We should be good. Save Jill. Hope that this is the key. Because if it's not, then I don't know. Yes. Come on, Jill. Jill, sorry I made you wait. I knew you'd come. Let's get out of here. Now we're thing is back up here. We're beginning to the elevator. If I'm not right. I was thinking for a sec, did we ever open that door? B2? I'm like, oh yeah, we did. We sure did. Oh, shit. Should've got HP. Let's get an HP. A storage tank. What the hell is that about? Oh, we do have an HP. We still have this key, master key. Huh? That's odd. Talk to me, Jill. What's going on? Now let's go back get a H another HP. Get two HPs. Just in case. 
Just in case. Bro, I have so much HPs. Like, literally. I have HP for like a whole month. Every day of the month. And there's more HPs. Give me a shotgun. What's this? Ah, oh, no. Had to use it. Take care of them. What? Chris, you just get in contact with Brad somehow. Okay. Darn it. I had two HP, now I only have one. Come on, bruh. And who would leave that fuse power supply unit or whatever on the ground like that? Really? Fourth of July. You okay? Good job, Joe. Wait. That's it. We don't get to fight the boss. No way. Let's go, we did it. We did it, boys and girls. GG. Well, 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 ladies and gentlemen, we finally did it. I mean, that ending wasn't so, I don't know, epicness, but I mean, I was expecting a boss fight, bro. Did you see how much HP I had? I mean, how many rounds of ammo I had on me? But anyways, it was pretty cool. Love the beginning, love the middle. The ending was so, so. I think it's because the first, you know, the first run through with Chris like this. But I hope you guys enjoyed it, man. Hope you guys enjoyed the uh, original Resident Evil remake, Resident Evil One. Hope you, had, you hope you guys had your blast. Hope you had your funny moments, your scary moments, you know, your butt wild moments. I appreciate you all for being here and always being there for me, checking me out, supporting me, got my back. You know who you are, my millions and millions of viewers, but until next time guys, 
I mean, I don't, I don't know what I should do next. Should I finish the, uh, do the Jill run? Now that I did the Chris run, should I do the Jill? Y'all let me know. Y'all let me know. Because I might just jump to a next, next uh, Resident Evil, like Resident Evil 2 or something. But I might do the Jill one. I might. Anyways, y'all. Until next time, everybody. Love y'all. Y'all be good. Y'all be safe. Be cool. Peace out. Chris, you did a fine job.